Hey guys, in this video I'll be showing you how to boot up your programs a lot faster than they usually do. This is a trick called Prefetch and it was showed to me by my friend Justin, so thank you for showing me this trick. And uh, basically all you do is you change the file destination to uh, another location and it somehow just opens up your programs a lot quicker. So let me show you how this works. So I got uh, Adobe After Effects on my desktop and I'm going to boot it up and uh, my computer is pretty fast so it shouldn't be that slow but uh, I know a lot of people out there have really slow computers and uh, it takes ages to open up programs, especially Adobe uh, programs. So let's uh, open up Adobe After Effects here. And it's not opening yet, um, so just wait a few seconds. And I haven't even seen the splash screen yet, so there we go. Okay, now I gotta hit accept. So now let's see how fast it takes to open up. Okay, so here's the splash screen. Uh, it's almost open. Okay, this is taking a lot longer than it usually does, but whatever. I'll speed it up after. Okay, so it's almost open. Oh my god, this is taking forever. Usually it opens up a lot faster. Even without using the prefetch trick, but... Okay, so what was that, like a minute? Anyway, so here's After Effects, it just opened up. Now let me show you how to speed it up. And of course it doesn't respond. Every time I make a tutorial, my computer screws up. Usually it's not that bad. So, okay, so that took quite a while. So let me show you how to speed that up. So what you do is right click on any program. It could be Firefox, Sony Vegas, Photoshop, Dreamweaver, uTorrent, whatever. Just right click on it, scroll down to Properties, and right here, this is what we're going to be uh, editing. Target. And then it's got all this crap. Uh, so don't backspace anything. Just leave it the way it is. What you're going to do is go to the last character, which is usually a quotation mark. And uh, hit space, forward slash, prefetch, colon, one. Like that. So it should uh, be the same file destination, but at the end it should be space, forward slash, prefetch, colon, one. So that's all you do. You just uh, edit the target so that it says... Uh, you know, uh, C Drive, Program Files, Adobe, After Effects, CS4, whatever. So I uh, just leave that, but add uh, space forward slash prefetch colon one. So let me do that again. Okay, so you got the same file destination. Go to the last character, space forward slash prefetch colon. Oh, I spelled that wrong. Make sure you don't spell it wrong. Prefetch colon one. Very simple. Hit apply. Hit OK. Now let's see how fast it boots up. Hit accept. Okay, so here's the splash screen. And it looks like it's going pretty quickly. And boom! That was so much faster than it was before. Way faster. So that's basically it. Let me do it with one more program. One that doesn't take forever to open up. How about Firefox? Okay. Get rid of After Effects. So here's Firefox, and uh, let me just check this. Okay, so it's just that normal. So let's open it up. Okay, so that was actually really quick. I don't even really need to do the prefetch, but uh, maybe it can open up even faster. So that was actually extremely quick, but let's uh, change it anyway. So right click it, properties, and target. So space, forward slash, prefetch, colon one. That's it. Hit apply, hit OK. And uh, for this, you probably won't see so too much of a difference because uh, it was already really quick to open, but you never know. So open it up. So I think it was the same speed, maybe just a bit faster, but you know, you can experiment with that. So maybe it'll make a difference, maybe not. I don't really know how it works, but it does work. So uh, it speeds up your program's boot time. It doesn't speed up the program itself, it just makes it uh, start up faster. That's all it does. But I don't know how it works, but it works really well. So thanks, Justin, for showing me how to do that. And uh, thank you for watching this video. Uh, please rate the video, comment if you like, uh, subscribe, favorite, whatever. But that's about it. So thanks for watching. Take care.